We've completed the first couple of parts of the wheel. We've done all sorts of different types of knots here and in the second ring, different ways to embroider leaves. I've decided what I'm going to do in the next circle. And these are going to be stitches which involve covering areas and also stitches which include weaving. And we're going to start with Jacobean couching. So let's do some Jacobean couching. I've drawn a little heart shape on my first bit of this third bit of the wheel. And I'm bringing my thread up on the outer edge here, a, a bit of away from the tip. And I'm going to do crisscross lines. So we're going to take it down immediately across parallel to the outer line of the heart and then we're going to take one this way and back again and the the secret here is to get them parallel I'm going to show you some bits of Jacobean catching afterwards that I've done on my actual work so continue to take it down and obviously equidistant is quite important as well let's try that I'm using red because it's a heart no other reason We'll do one final one there. And now all you need to do is cross the other way. Now it's a good idea um, to start not at the edge. So I started sort of halfway here. And then what we're looking to do is to put in the stitch across the shape at right angles to the previous lines. So that's not right angles, that's about right angles. So the edge, a corner shape, make sure you look for a corner shape. And then put a stitch down. And then let's do one this side. You're looking to make little squares. And stitch down. And then across the top. Stitch down. And I think we'll do one more. To complete the heart shape. Now finish off at the back and then we're going to use a different colour to secure the, the, the net shape that you've made. So to secure the, the, the lines down. So with a, a contrasting colour, come up at the intersection of one of these uh, stitches here and make a little stitch make a little stitch just to secure the thread. So it's the tiniest of stitches don't make them too big.
and it's great if you can really contrast the, the, the colour so that you can see these tiny little stitches here. Doesn't matter what order you do them in, random is fine. And if you think you've got a rectangle rather than a square, you can sort of go the other way and adjust it slightly. So you want one as well, right on the edge. If you've got an intersection, you want a little stitch. Make sure that you're crossing if you, if you decide to cross your stitches vertically, that they're always vertical. So from there to there on each occasion and not east to west or vice versa. Now you can do them all east to west if you like, but make sure it's the same and it's consistent. You can also, as an alternative, use a little cross stitch. So you can do both and then you don't have to worry. So I think I quite like it like this for this particular little shape. So I'm going to complete that now and then we're going to do a split back stitch outline around the heart shape just to finish it off. I've started my split back stitch around the edge here. I started at the tip of the heart and I haven't got much thread so I'm coming up through my stitch from behind. I'm doing smaller stitches on the curves so that they don't look jagged and that will finish off my heart nicely. So when you get down the edge, you can make your stitches a little bit longer if you wish. And that's complete. Well done. I've got a couple of examples of Jacobean couching to show you. This is on my pomegranate and I've done the little uh, stitches at the intersection as a cross stitch. They're the yellow ones there. And I've also put a French knot in each of the square so you can embellish it a little bit and then this is the sleeve of my angel the sleeve and the upper part of the dress actually and you can see how Jacobean couching can be used on top of an area that's already been stitched the underneath to this uh, Jacobean is long and short stitch which I'm going to show you next but on top I've done a little stitch, looks like a cross stitch there, in gold. So that's another thing that you can do with the Jacobean couching.